All right, well, morning, everyone. Well, my second attempt. I just can't seem to get my shit together this morning. Uh, but cast time once again, and the name of this album is going to be Garden Gnome, uh, Utter Pandanomium. Anyway, um, this just came in yesterday. It's, uh, it's some uh, dungeon synth, so let me rewind this back from the beginning. Hopefully, I got the sound right this time. It was one of the reasons why I had a count why I had a count in my last attempt. Just having to like move the sound up and down too much. It was really interfering, so. Um, but otherwise kind of a somewhat busy busy day yesterday and this morning. Um kind of continuation off from yesterday. I'm I'm trying to get up. I created a new PayPal account. Because uh, I had a problem with my subscriptions, or on my uh, my Twitch subscriptions, uh, people were actually seeing my real name, and I thought it would just be a simple matter of going right on in and just simply changing the name, or at the very least, adding a nickname. Nope. Um, in order to do that, I had to provide photo ID, and I had to provide some kind of documentation, like, like a birth certificate or a pay stub or something like that, like, online. So I'm like, no. So I started looking for alternatives, and there are none. Um, I know uh, one of the sites I was looking at. I actually had to contact one of the one of the members of that particular website. Like, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Oh, I it looked like I had a I had a I had to have somebody vouch for me in order to use their in order to use their services. I'm like. No. So, but uh, what uh, what PayPal ended up doing is uh, they had they they had to make two deposits in my account, but the problem is I haven't gotten them. So I think remember in this issue before, I think I have to actually talk to my bank and uh, let them know, and because they they might be blocking these two uh these two deposits because they're suspicious. So I gotta. I probably gonna have to talk to them. See if I can get the matter resolved. So But yeah, I just I did kinda I kinda thought about it too. I don't think um as far as I know, I don't think they can even uh, subscribe to my channel. Cause uh I closed out my PayPal account yesterday in order to make a new one, but then but then uh I hit this snag, so big issue I mean I mean not I mean not that I get like hundreds of thousands of subscriptions or, or hundreds of thousands of subscriptions or anything like that but you know the few that want to subscribe to my channel I really want I would really like them to so I'd really like to have this option available to them But otherwise, um, I didn't stream any pinball yesterday. I just wasn't up for it. Um, I just recorded a one-hour session and just uploaded that to Twitch. Um, uh, but, uh, actually the session went pretty good. It went all right. Um, I mean, I, I mean, I definitely wasn't amazing or anything like that. But, um, for the most part, I was fundamentally sound. Like, I, I wasn't totally, ter I was far from terrible. But, um, you know, but I think, um, now that I, now that I can recall, there's probably, uh, there was one or two tables where I just ended up bailing out of, because it, 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 it just wasn't working out, so, I figured it'd be best to just quit while I was ahead, but again, the rest of the time, though, I did pretty good. Um, but otherwise, I mean, otherwise, I just, just did my usual slobbing and napping. Just watching a few off-the-wall things. Um, I watched a, I watched a YouTube video about fighting game archetypes, like grapplers, zoners, and whatnot, so 
That actually got me a little inspired to... I fired up, um, I fired up Fantasy Strike, despite me not being the world's biggest fan of it. And just, um, just played some Rook, just fiddle farting around on him for a little while. Then, um, fired up some, um, um, Ultra Street Fighter 4. Um, in keeping with my, uh, tradition of playing, playing Grapplers, uh, fired up some Zangief. Not as... I'm not as much of a fan of it. It, it, cause it from from watching the tournament, watching uh, tournament footage, and um, uh, watching uh, other key players, it seems the spinning pile driver is a requirement. But um, in order to do that, I probably have the same problem that a lot of other people had. If I'm I'm trying to do a full circle motion, but I end up jumping instead. So yeah, it was like a like a major major execution problem. Uh, so I just but I, I guess as, a, as far as fighting games go, if I was forced to choose, I'd rather play Street Fighter Four than Fantasy Strike. At least as, at least as far as like 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 overall look and aesthetic and all that and. It's not not really saying much because I'm not a fan of the uh, Street Fighter 4 aesthetic either. But like I said, it, it's basically I'm choosing the lesser of the two evils. But mechanically, uh, mechanically, yeah, Rook all the way. I mean, he's he's basically a cheap knockoff of Zangief. But on the upside, though, his uh, I mean, even his normal throws are spinning pile drivers, which. <clears throat> Which on one hand, again, aesthetically, it's kind of lame. But on the other hand, at least they're a hell of a lot easier to pull off. Just one button. So. I think there was... I think there was something else I was wanting to say, too. Oh yeah, um, yeah. This this is most certainly gonna be a this most certainly is gonna be a short cast. Um, mainly because one, aside from the stuff that I just talked about, I really didn't do a whole lot. And uh, two, um, I forgot to buy uh, I forgot to buy oatmeal last night. S something for my uh my four to four thirty a.m. meal. So, um, I have to cut up. I have to kind of break this off sooner. I have, excuse me. I have to kind of do this sooner than normal because I gotta make a walk to the convenience store and buy a 4 a.m. meal, um, basically junk food. So, so aside from the fact that I have a junk food addiction, like I can't live without it, and if I see something I like on the counter, I grab it, because I'm not a big fan. I'm I'm not a big fan of willpower or quote unquote discipline. After uh, after doing that, you know, after using that to get my weight down from 210 to 140, and ended up but ended up snapping and going on a week long junk food binge. So, what the the whole the whole willpower and discipline thing really isn't for me, at least not in the way it's traditionally depicted. So, so again, um, junk food it's also a form of punishment as well for you know for for messing up, for making big mistakes like this, because again, I now have to go to a convenience store and get a 4 a.m. meal. So, which is probably going to be, ah, uh, what do they sell? I know they sell pasta salad, um, spiral pasta salad. I hope they have that. And then I might get a donut or two, because my favorite kind of junk food is um, old-fashioned chocolate donuts. So I might get one or two of those while I'm there. So, yeah. But otherwise, oh, and um, I just now noticed this too. This is uh, this album is only a 13-minute album. So even then, I'd probably have to cut it short anyway. So, uh, but otherwise, hey, thanks for tuning in and listening to me, everybody, for the short amount of time that I was actually on. Um, and then um, I'm gonna. 
set to getting this thing uploaded and processed and all that. And while that's going on, um, once again, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go down across the street to my convenience store and get a get my 4 a.m. meal since my brain fucking farted and I forgot to buy oatmeal. So, but, uh, I mean, I sh and I'm on big, I, and I'm on vacation this week. My my mind's kind of racing right now. I'm I'm on vacation this week, so. I should be able to do another one of these tomorrow morning. So, but until then, thanks for tuning in, or thanks again for listening, everybody, and see you all next time. Bye for now.